Well, greetings and salutations, everybody. Welcome back once again for the very first time to the Thoughts and Corrupt Show, where today, as per usual, it's your host, Anjo, here with part nine. Yeah, it's part nine of Ming Men Legends. Hope you guys are all doing well. Finally, finally, at the end of the previous episode, um, figured out what to do, which I was pretty sure what to do, um, that we had to go to the boat shop to get to Lake June, um, but the mayor also said something about the closer woods, closer ruins, closer gate or whatever, um, so I tried going over there, and no, I did didn't seem to be a way to access it, um, and I couldn't find anything else that we could do right now, so I think this is pretty much the only thing. Because yeah, when I first came here in the last episode, I talked to these guys and I tried this door and I tried that door and they're like, nope, nothing. And so I was like, oh guess this isn't what we're supposed to do right now and then came back and tried it again and it worked and I, I don't know I don't know why kind of weird but um it's the boat call roll let's rock and roll <laughs> Mega Man are you ready yep let's go here we go it's making go. It's a good hard look at the mother I'm on a boat. I'm picking something up on the sonar. Keep an eye out, Mega Man. Sonar. I knew it. They're here. The robots are here. Oh no, my L2 is her R2 is sticking. Mission start! Water battle. Protect your boat from the enemy's attack. Shoot and destroy the red subs torpedoes and the yellow ship's missiles before they hit the ship. Mission start! Can't I just shoot them? Haha, <laughs> sucker. Ow, jeez. Alright, I think we're good. I mean, I have to wait for them to get into range. Mega Man, ahead. Yeah. Shit. Uh, it's not letting me lock. Oh, there we go. Nope. Oh, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Don't relax yet, Mega Man. Yeah, got it. Multiple signals on my sonar. There's a lot of little signals coming from around this ship. Uh, yeah, it's called fish. mode you actually don't have to hold R2 to aim up and down. 
Huh. Mega Man, ahead. Yeah. Yep. Come on, get him. That was a missile. Gotcha. Can I change my buster parts? Cause like... I guess I need range more than... Energy in range? Probably attack in range. Seeing any targets roll. Mega Man behind us. Hey, that's nice. Mm, yeah. Do that range. Oh shit. Come on, really? Aren't these all Wily's boats, though? Like, I mean, I get it, they're hijacked by the pirates, but like, oh, there you are. Get him. I mean, I no. Can see it on the sonar. Heads up, Mega Man. Something big coming this way. <laughs> Something big. I knew our little blue boy'd show up. I figured we'd run into him sooner or later if we waited here. Slow ahead. Slow ahead. <laughs> Extra slow. Actually, hey, stop! Not cool, man. We're out, God. We can't fight them head to head like this. We need a different strategy. Uh huh. How? Why can I not? What should we do? Fight or retreat? Fight? We can beat him. Okay, Mega Man, hold on. Cause it's gonna get rough. Uh, roll. It kind of looks like we're retreating. Where, where are we going? Ah, uh, wait. Why? No, lock. 
Mann. Yeah, I'm alright. No, I'm just shooting missiles. Yeah, it is. I mean, yeah, right? Got him. Do they think they can beat us? Yeah. Oh no! It's fine. Shut up! Stop your whining! We still have one weapon, don't we? Uh the arm? It's like screwing up because of the auto lock. I don't mind using There we go. Yeah, turn it off. Because, like, it kind of makes manual aiming, like, impossible. Wait, it's still doing it. There we go. I don't think those are hitting anyway. Like, what do I even aim for? Oh, shit. Yeah, those missiles they're firing aren't even hitting. Come on. Come on, get them. Got him. Got him. You're all. Status report. This is the engineer reporting. Our engines are completely offline. There's flooding in the main hall. Everything's just really fucked over here. I'm sorry, Tron, after you went to all the trouble to make us such a magnificent robot. What can I say? Cheer up, Diesel. Don't worry. We'll go back to the ship and come up with a new plan. Yeah, that's it. That's the spirit. Thanks, you two. Now, I couldn't have asked for a better brother and sister than you. We'll get that blue boy next time for sure. <laughs> I don't understand. Even though he got the better of us again, I don't feel the least bit angry. Why is that? Also, Babu, like, so wait, hold on, so their names are Teasel, Bon, and Tron, but they're also known as the Bonds. Here we are at the island ruins, wanna save? Uh, recharge energy? Uh... Damn me! 
anyway, I, I, I've already pointed that out before, but so the Babu's name is Bon Bon. I, I guess anyway, it was the only one being hauled off by a magnet. It was kind of it's too large for like the little pod things, I, I guess. I don't know about lock on. More and more vicious, aren't they? Using the lock on function? Yeah. That's my Mega Man. I was sure you knew about that. Yeah, they told us about it in the tutorial. Did that show up because they just turned it off? Huh. What should I do now? This is Lake Some Gate. Okay, it's probably refractor inside somewhere. When I go back to town, you'll have to take the boat. How do I take the boat? Is it just use the walkie talkie like I'm walkie talkie diehard motherfucker? Where is oh the boat's right here. Okay, gotcha. Nev man. Um, I mean, I'm assuming we have to do this first. Besides, I want to use the whoa. That was weird. You want to try out the blade, man? Alright, Mega Man, let's get started. Surprise? Oh. I upgraded the support equipment to the boat. I should be able to access your father from here too. I wonder if that old fella used to be a bigger thing. not locking on. Okay. So that does do really good damage. Is that... Is that a hole in the wall? Oh, these are holes. Okay. I wasn't sure if that was, like, just how it's supposed to look, or... That's how the holes look in this level. It seems to be the latter. Okay. But yeah, those things deal a ton of damage. Downside is obviously um, you have to get like right up in their face, and it doesn't really like stun them or anything. Is it that good? I mean, I think because of the the range problem, it's not actually that great. Like, if I could get behind enemies, like, sure. It would be good, but like when? Because I mean, sometimes I can. Whoa! And yeah, if you could like consistently stagger enemies. It would be good. Uh, 
However... It's, uh, not really the way it works. And, like, because I wanted to try it out, like, it's already pretty much done. And is that even with the... Yeah, the Kevlar jacket, yeah. So we're even reducing damage by half. But, uh, it's just really hard to stay out of, um... Stay out of harm's way. Like, uh, yeah. With the blade, which... I don't know why it's doing that. Um... Not really great. Not really great. Um... Alright, so I guess I have to actually just recharge energy. There we go. Um, she did say she outfitted the boat. No. Wait, I thought you said you put the support car shit back in the boat. Can I not... So, the pirates stole my boats and used them to make that giant robot, eh? Wonder what they were planning to do out in the ruins. Uh, steal a refractor shard? Okay, so in order to change my special weapon, I still have to use the support car. Even though... I must have made that giant robot out of the boats, they stole... Eh, no shit! Good thing I didn't go fishing after all, they might have attacked me, right? That I have to do it like this is so dumb. I mean, I get it. Sport car has a lot of equipment in it and whatever, but uh, special like uh, yeah. You know what? Let's check item development. All right, that's fine. Yeah, we're all, all right. Change. So blade arm, cool. In concept, like if the range was a little bit better, the, pr the problem is like the cooldown. Like in order to use it, you have to stand still for like a hot minute. Yeah, so far grenade arm is my favorite. Like the best I have at the moment. Ammo. Range doesn't really matter. Yeah, never mind. I'm not gonna spend more on enhancing it right now. Seems like kind of a waste. Um. Okay. And we got like ten minutes left. All right. I didn't talk to you yet, did I? Wonder what's going on. It looked like there was something happening. On the surface of the lake a while ago. Yeah, there was. Color. I mean, I guess I should have tried out special weapon before out there. You know, I should probably save again. Just... I mean, I'm probably gonna come back out here anyway, but... All right, Mega Man. Parts, equip. Yeah, I don't need the range thing anymore. Um, let's go with the machine gun thing again, because that's really good. Damn, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Don't hear what I'm saying. Like, that is so much better. Good job. 
Only the echoes. Damn. That was just so good. How many of these do I have? Forty. Okay, that's actually really good. Fuck. Keep forgetting to hit start instead of back. It still auto locks a little bit at least. So I don't really know what's up with the. Uh... Oh wow. The hover jets. This is the first time where the high jump is actually required, right? Honestly, didn't even see that guy. Mm-hmm. Taking those guys out is just like super lucrative. So we get three different paths. Sorry, I'm just gonna start on the left then. Gatling part, okay. Cool, cool. Uh, which... Starter key. What did you find? From these readings, it looks like a starter key. That means there's probably... Oh no, it cuts off the voice line? Really? Oh, both of these go the same way. 
Huh. I didn't know that happens if you open the map. This is the only other way to go, so... Mega Man, what can you see up there? I'm not picking up anything on my monitor. I don't know. I've got a bad feeling about this. Seem to be behind some kind of waterfall. Oh, hello. I mean, can't see this on your monitor. That does not bode well. There was that other way to go. Um, kind of look like a locked door, I assume. Oh, it's not locked. Okay. Oh, I think this is the same room. Hmm. Yeah. Can I make that? Oh, that's kind of cool. Nice little effect they got to make it look like... I mean, it looks kind of terrible, like... When you just see the pattern repeating itself ad nauseum. But, like, individually, it looks pretty good. Um, I'm gonna try to make this. Wah! Nope. Alright. It feels like you can jump further if you jump sideways. Shit. No. Oh, these... Holy crap, he just camouflaged himself. Holy shit, those guys do not fuck around. So this is just a big ass hub, huh? Did I already no, I couldn't go over there, right? So in this whole big ass room, that's the only way to go. At least from, you know, this side. Oh, these fuckers. Holy shit, that's a lot of damage. Okay. 
All right, I'm gonna use that canteen now. Yep. It's even with the half damage Kevlar. Like, oh shit, they have really good range. of like yeah. oh oh shit shouldn't have risked it for that oh. yeah no hit the there oh come on rude are so fucking strong, like, what the hell? Hmm? Did that just connect? Hold on, I can find this out now, too. Oh, that bounced right off. There's a wall in the way. Maybe if you had something to break through it with. Okay. Hmm. Maybe I just kind of missed something? No. There's gotta be a specific item. That responds all those alligator dudes. Might be kind of screwed. been here all right can proceed because they didn't have the thing to take out like dirt walls Which, again big ass dirt walls <gasps> oh rapid striker You know, to be fair, it doesn't tell you what type the items are when you pick them up, so... Yep. That is indeed... Oh, Rapid Plus 2. That'd be worth it? Because, I mean, the Energy Plus 3... I feel like it evens out because, like, you have to pause more frequently. Hmm. 
All right, folks. Well, we're over on time. And I'm quite damaged. Um, shit, yeah, they're back. I think I should probably just run. Fuck, that hurt. What the hell is this? Don't tell me this is a boss fight. the refractor shard. Easy peasy, and let me guess, this baby doesn't activate until you actually grab your refractor shard. More than likely. And I'm just gonna run real quick, because I have a feeling... Well, I mean, it's more than a feeling. More than a feeling! But, um... I have a feeling the other direction is probably some pretty dope treasure. <sighs> kind of looked close enough, so I was like, maybe. Also, I didn't like fully explore down here. Gotta take the other door to get to those other optional areas, which I definitely want to do. Which was what left. And I know we're over on time, I just want to see what's over here. Oh, it's literally just... Oh, start a key. Really, Roll? You don't have anything to say about the other starter key that I just found. Can I jump from here? Hold on. over on that side so there's no other reason no not really no All right. I don't want to go into this boss fight without full health though so I mean, that's like mostly full health. 
And I mean, I can't refill the canteen without going back to the jump shop and junk shop. So, may as well do it now. Um, no, it was close. Let's see if, uh, oops. was possible. Yeah, I'm just gonna avoid these guys completely. They are quite dangerous. One that big. Wait, what? But how does the big guy have the third one? I kind of checked everywhere. There? I'm not picking up anything on my radar. Um. Is it like a hole in the wall thing? Oh, it might be. Because in that big room, I didn't check all the walls. These guys are just going to kill me if I stay put, so... Sorry, check that. So I need to check what all the pillars. Sorry, check this one. There wasn't anything here. Check that. Get over there. I, mean, I guess this is the only platform that looks like maybe it's close enough, and I already tried this. further, but I don't think... 
Ow. Come on, Magma, it's not that hard of a concept. Jump the last second, dingus. Alright, never mind. Wait, did I see this passageway? Fuck, I did not see that passageway before. Because I looked to the right. And uh, it's got to be down here then. Oh. See, that makes a lot more sense. It's got to be the last starter key. go. Neat. Almost at 40k Zenny again? Wow. Whoa. Whoa. Then I was like, whoa. them while strafing. Well, I did not know that before. Oh, you can just throw them while running. It's kind of awesome. Very nearly dead. Um, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This does seem like a decent place, though, for uh, grinding for fracture shards, mostly, because, like, gotta be, what, like, at 45? Yeah, about 45k. Um, which, I mean, probably also develop some items too. So let's go back. Yeah. Yeah. Because I want to get the residential houses fixed. Um, and check out the support car, see if some of the items that we picked up can be used for a uh, item development, which I'm pretty sure we get 
at least one new thing. Um, and what else? There's another thing I was going to say. Oh, and go to the junk shop to refill the uh, energy canteen. Yeah. Um, but yeah, that is going to do it for today, folks, because we're already over on time. But um, yeah, thank you all for being here. Greatly appreciate it. Hope you guys enjoyed. And of course, before we get going, it is time for the members wall. A very special thank you going out to the current Farts and Crap Show members, which at the time of recording is Novalis Draconis. But if you want to be incredibly awesome and support the show a bit more directly and get in on all those membership benefits like Novalis Draconis do, uh, check out the join button down below. Tier start at 3 bucks a month, only 10 cents a day gets you into all the basic stuff. Or you can go do that over at the Parts and Craft Show Buy Me a Coffee. Uh, links right there down in the description as well. And um, yeah, we already had the August Members Choice poll that was to select this series. But we will definitely have another one in September if we don't need a new series by then then uh, we'll probably do it preemptively, or it'll be stream-related, something of that nature, which would actually work out for September, since September is looking pretty stacked right now. So, um, but yeah, it's going to do it for now. Thank you all for being here, guys, once again. And until next time, take care, and I hope you all have a fan-freaking-tastic day.